Hi, this is Brian with another mini chapter from A Philosopher's Notes. This one's called 99% is a bitch, 100% is a breeze. Jack, chicken soup for the soul Canfield, has a great line. He says, 99% is a bitch, 100% is a breeze. It's classic. Are you looking to start a new habit? That thing you just know you could be doing that it totally take your life to the next level if you did it consistently might be meditating exercising journaling reading more eating well or some other empowering habit you could add to your life or you might be trying to stop an old habit might be no longer yelling at your kids or zoning out in front of the tv aimlessly surfing the internet smoking drinking whatever if you failed to make a habit either stick or go away i'd be willing to bet you have a 99 percent at best commitment but as Sir Canfield tells us, 99% is a bitch. 100%, that's where it's at. Let's say you commit to meditating every day for the rest of your life. One of my commitments that I've been rocking for two plus years at this point. Now, if you do that, you're bound to wake up one day with that whiny little voice inside your head that says, you know, we deserve a day off today. I mean, come on, we're tired. What's one day off? Don't be a freak about it, relax. If you only have a 99% commitment, you might respond with, hmm, you know, you're right. We do deserve a day off, huh? One day won't hurt. Yeah, let's take the day off, then we'll crush it tomorrow. And wham, you're screwed. Habit installation thwarted. 10 days later, you wonder what happened to your meditation practice. The solution? We've got to identify what's really important in our lives. Then pick one thing we're absolutely 100% committed to rocking and make our commitment non-negotiable. Not 99% or 99.8%, 100%. Then, when that little whiny voice pops up, which it will, we just ignore it and go on with creating an awesome life. So, uh, what are you going to make a 100% commitment to? Remember, 99% is a bitch, 100% is a breeze. What is so important in your life that you need to step up and make it a 100% commitment? Don't pick two or three or four or five things. Pick one thing, the number one thing that you're going to make a 100% commitment to. Get out there and rock it. Hope you enjoyed this little mini chapter and looking forward to sharing more with you soon. In the meantime, have an awesome day. Mm -hmm.